Hello again, young bibliophiles. Miss Stacy with another edition of Imagination Time, and today we're talking about St. Patrick's Day. I have my green leprechaun hat, and we're going to read a book called The Itsy Bitsy Leprechaun by Jeffrey Bird. The Itsy Bitsy Leprechaun was hiding pots of gold. That's what they're supposed to do, isn't it? Down came a rainbow, colorful and bold. Isn't that pretty? Out came his friends, and they all began to look. For the perfect four-leaf clover hidden in this nook. There's a four-leaf clover somewhere. I wonder if we can see it. I see a lady, but oh, there it is. The itsy bitsy leprechaun loved to search and find. With his good luck, he was magical and kind. They found the plant, and the leprechaun did say, May the sun shine upon you. Happy St. Patrick's Day. That was a cute story. We do have a few days before St. Patrick's Day, but it'll be here soon. Today we have a flannel board featuring a leprechaun. See, leprechaun, leprechaun, what lucky charms have ye? I have a red heart here with me. Leprechaun, leprechaun, what lucky charms have ye? I have an orange star here with me. Leprechaun, le leprechaun, what lucky charms have ye? I have a yellow moon here with me. Leprechaun, leprechaun, what lucky charms have ye? I have a green clover here with me. Leprechaun, leprechaun, what lucky charms have ye? I have a blue diamond here with me. Leprechaun, leprechaun, what lucky charms have ye? I have a purple horseshoe here with me. Let's see what colors we have. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple. And what does that make? That makes a rainbow. That's what you find at the leprechaun's pot of gold, isn't it? A rainbow book featuring a leprechaun today. This is How to Catch a Leprechaun by Adam Wallace. The night is dark, the streets are quiet, St. Patrick's Day is near. I tap my hammer so you know the leprechaun is here. There he is, he's got his hammer. I'll pull out your later laces, put glitter in your hair, and when you walk around you'll see my gold coins everywhere. Yeah, they are, it's, that's a not very nice trick, is it? You'll never catch me in your trap, but yes, I'll make a scene. I'll turn the whole place upside down. Your toilet will be green. Oh, that's yucky, isn't it? How? House number one, I'm going in. Really? That's your trap? I'm in and out without a doubt. That was one, that one was a snap. They put a big mouse trap out to catch the leprechaun. And now I think it's getting worse. A shoebox on a stick? I'll dance a jig and still escape. We leprechauns are quick. He thought he could trap him there, didn't he? Another house. I fixed your shoes. They really were quite smelly. I'll eat the nuts you left as bait and leave with a full belly. Like you wash with the shoes in the sink to wash. And there's a bunch of nuts. Now you're talking, look at this. It's dandelion tea, but I'm too speedy for your trap. This tea is mine for free. He's drinking the tea up in me. They put a net up to catch him that time. I know you want my pot of gold, that iron cage was clever, but I've been alive 200 years. You won't catch me, ever. Look at that, he didn't make it, did he? And he's laughing, ha 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 ha, now you're getting fancy, but I'll escape with twinkle toes, it's a fancy pantsy dancy. That she's shooting unicorns at him, isn't she? She didn't catch him. It seems to me an engineer else helped me with this design. Too bad this little leprechaun is going to be just fine. Look at that. They got a fancy trap for him there, didn't he? But there's a boot. Off he went. Missed him again. Your entire house is one big trap from the ceiling to the floor. Nice try indeed, but soon enough, I'll stroll right out the door. Look at that. They got, looks like a laser and a robot and a lot of music and a weight. And it says, totally safe place for leprechauns, but it's not, is it? The leprechaun be gone 3,000 gave me quite a scare, but without a four-leaf clover, I won't be caught in there. There's that real bite. And that goes the leprechaun. You'll never catch this leprechaun. Impossible, that's a fact. Unless one day a brilliant child designs the perfect trap. Here's the big hole he left behind. But who will be that child be? There's all the kids in there looking for a way to trap the leprechaun right there. Better luck next year. There he is. He's back at home. He's got his sack of gold and his hammer and his tea. 
Thank you for joining us today. You have a great week. Everyone, welcome to Craft Time. We're going to be making a St. Patrick's Day craft. Um, what you'll need is a white stock piece of white paper and then some green construction paper. You'll need six hearts and one little piece like that for the stem of the um, clover. So what we're going to do is we're going to cut out the pieces and then put them together. hearts cut out and our stem so what I did first was I glued on the stem so I can start putting the clover flowers on there okay so just put it kind of down close to the bottom but not all the way to the bottom like that and then what you're going to do is you're going to take all your hearts and you're going to fold them in half try to get them as even as you can and then we'll start gluing all right all right so what I did was I started with the one on the top first so I took my stick glue and I put it on the left side because you're going to go left and right with each one that you put down. Oops. So just kind of put it towards the middle there. Glue it down. And so now I'm going to put this one. Uh, yeah, on the right side. Kind of threw me off there for a minute. Sorry about that. Okay, and you're going to put it right, right close to the other one, like that. Get it as close as you can. And then you're just going to do that over on the other side. should look like that so far and then we'll get the last pieces and you can write on this craft you know I'll say happy St. Think uh, happy St. Patrick's Day or to mom or dad or to brother or sister whoever you want all right and there you go and you kind of push them down so they'll stay down a little bit And there you go. If you have any questions, just give us a call. We do have the uh, little packets of take home that you can take home with this craft in it. Have a good day.